big cheesy smile for her. Pipes, do you like nanners? Want to try? <laughs> Ay, are you excited? <laughs> she already got a shower today, and I think she's gonna need another one. Are you ready to eat some food? Yeah. My pretty girl. Five course meal. Mom is made for you. We are going to be introducing Harlow to solid foods today. First, she's starting on her chair just to make sure her two little teeths are ready. Got some little teeths in there ready for some food? She is going to be six months old in a couple days. So by the time you see this, she will already be six months old. I don't know where the time went. That's so freaking crazy. But um, her pediatrician said a few months ago, she started drooling an insane amount at about three months, maybe a little earlier. And he basically said, whenever she's drooling that much and interested in your food, she is ready for solids. He said that they salivate a lot when they're ready for food. You want to touch my bracelets, don't you? Those are your favorites. So we're going to get started on it. Um, I think she might stay fuller for longer too if she supplements a little bit of food. But basically what they say is food before one is just for fun. So obviously don't take anything that we talk about or say in this video um, and apply it to your own life or your, with your baby. Um, do all of your own research, talk to your pediatrician and do what's right for you guys. Um, um, there are quite a few benefits to baby lead weaning. It helps improve their dexterity. It can reduce um, pickiness in like foods when they're a little bit older. What? It helps them regulate their, regulate their own appetite. It's a bit easier as a parent because you don't have to puree all the foods. Um, but any way that you feed your baby is up to you. This is just what we're choosing to try. And maybe we will do some purees. I actually wanted to do some purees and fill up some of those like reusable pouches when she's old enough to do that. Um, so most of this is gonna end up like on the ground or elsewhere. So make sure you make enough if you're gonna do this for them to like throw one and then still have an option. So um, a lot of people are worried about choking when it comes to baby led weaning. Um, but don't confuse choking with gagging. So gagging is actually a good thing because it prevents solids from going down into the back of the throat. You want to brace it again? So babies will gag when they're, um, putting things in their mouth and like learning it's, it, it's their body telling them, Hey, that's too far back there. So it's actually a good thing. Um, but luckily we have a daddy on hand right here over here who is a paramedic and knows how to deal with choking. But like I said, there is no right way. Um, there's only the right way for you and your baby. So pick and choose what you wanna do. You can mix and match purees if you wanna feed. You can do a little bit of baby led weaning. Um, you can mix the two, but she is still on formula. So this is just an introduction. Like I said, food before one is just for fun. So I'm not planning on her necessarily filling up um, or getting a meal out of this. It's more so just for her to like experience new tastes and textures. So no matter what you choose, it is just a really good idea when you start introducing solids for them to experience different textures, tastes, all that kind of stuff. So are you ready? Are you ready? I did actually grab a mango for today as well, but while I was cutting it, it started getting like really like um, stringy and that I would be concerned about her choking on. So we decided to get rid of that, but we've got everything else. I really hope you love avocados as much as I do. <laughs> like how long ago was it where she started to, I'm talking off camera cause Nick's sitting over here. How long ago was it when she started to like watch us put things in our mouth and like grab them or want to? I feel like it was like two months when she was like two months old. It was pretty early. Yeah, it was pretty early. <laughs> She's super, super aware of what's going on too. So she watches really intently and everything. So um, it's kind of like, it's been crazy because she's been drooling like crazy from a very young age and then also just like watching us and very interested in what we're eating and drinking. Um, so I feel like we could have done this even earlier, but here we are. So over here we have apples, banana, <laughs> she's reaching for it, avocados, broccoli, 
carrots, and banana. And what I did is I used like one of these like crinkle cutter things that I think was really cool. I got it for like $7 on Amazon. I'll link you guys to everything below as well as this chair, which has been awesome. It's also been really great helping her sit up. This little guy, it comes with, and it comes with three of these, which helps just give a little bit of texture to the side. So the goal is like to make things easy to grab because they don't have the best de dexterity, which is another good thing about baby lead weaning. Um, but are you ready? You look like you're about to take a nap. Hi. Okay, no more teasing, let's do it. And then I left the skin on this banana like this so that she can grab it. I saw that in a few videos and I was like, I don't understand why they're doing that. And now I get it. Are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> yep, look at your face. Dad, will you hold her arms real quick while I put everything on there? <laughs> We got this like plastic bib too. You can also get like a smock type of outfit that like goes on them and I would highly recommend because from what I've seen, it gets very messy. Use both hands. Okay. Two hands. Two hands. Okay. You know, all these things up. Which I that off. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. is they should be soft enough to squish and squeeze apart between your fingers. So it's kind of like over steaming, I guess. Just the way you like them. <laughs> <laughs> it's making fun of me because I like my vegetables like overcooked, overcooked and soft <laughs> and he likes them crunchy. It's so weird. When we first started dating, he told me that. I was like, this is going to be really difficult. Like I'm going to have to make two separate sets of veggies. Okay, you so have to make one longer. She's mm. never tasted food before. It's literally only been milk. So it's like, she, this is oh, totally new for her. What do you think? Gonna try again with the broccoli. Mm. A lot of smashing. She loves to smash things right now. So I feel kind of bad for these avocados because they're actually really good. Surprisingly, we found good avocados in Nashville. Um, and they're just gonna get destroyed. <laughs> the broccoli is making such a mess. I'll go try with the broccoli again. Oh, oh I don't like that. I forgot. See, that's easy for that's easy for you to grab. That's good. A lot of these are like so hard for them to grab, like the avocado is just like. I feel like you would like the carrots, kiddo. <clears throat> Why don't you try this one? It's orange. It looks like a fishy. Yeah. Wanna try it? Wanna try it? Good hold. Try the carrot. It's orange. broke off. I made it too long. <laughs> Consider a bib. Here. Did <laughs> she getting the skin now? Pipes, watch out. This might be easier for you to grab. Man, they're, oh, they're so slimy. Oh my god. She's tried like almost everything. Except you haven't grabbed any of the apples, I don't think. Or the avocado. <laughs> Most of this is gonna end up all over the ground and not in her mouth, but the idea is like she can grab it, she gets to pick what she wants to eat. 
Um, and I also read that it's just really important, no matter what way you choose to feed, that you just pay attention to hunger cues, cues that your baby is full, um, and all that kind of stuff. So we're newbies at the baby led weaning. Um, but if you're wondering what it means, it essentially just means that you are, um, it's baby led and weaning, I think I read was like, it was actually means like the opposite. It's like more of an introduction to food as opposed to the normal, like meaning of weaning that we know. So the idea, would you like that one? And the idea is just to let them pick and choose and skipping salt or skipping purees and going straight to solids, which is what we have here. some red bell pepper that would be like something like really bright for the tray which I think would be great I just didn't get any maybe next time you mamas out there who have a lot of experience with this please drop your knowledge um, and tips and tricks in the comments below I would love to read them and I'm sure other people starting out just like us watching this would love to see them too. I also wanted to remind you guys that I have a judgment free zone um, moms Facebook group that I started. So I'll leave the link for that for you guys in the description box as well. If you're interested in joining people bitch about their husbands on there, bitch about their partners on there, um, share really cute pictures of their babies, share pictures of rashes that they're not sure what they are to get advice. It's like a really cool um, place to go to share information without being like ridiculed and judged um, and spoken down to, which if you're watching this right now and you have children, then you are no, or maybe even you're just pregnant, you're thinking about it. You're no stranger to the fact that people just love to insert their opinions everywhere when it's unwarranted, unnecessary, unsolicited. So we don't put up with any of that in the group. The group is called The Real Moms Club. So you can probably type that in and find it too, but I'll also leave the URL for you in the description box. I don't think, uh, I don't think this is getting uh, any prettier over here and she seems to be kind of a little over it. So we're gonna clean this up while it's wet and uh, easier to clean up. And I am looking forward to reading some of your guys' tips. Some of you that are experienced mamas, cause we are brand new at all this. So. Um, thanks for watching guys, and we will see you in the next video. Bye. Good job. Oh, you're just gonna put your mouth, mouth on the whole tray and taste that? What'd you think? <laughs> what did you think? Did you have fun? Did that just take so much out of you, huh? Are you so tired now? Ready for a nap? Food coma? I'll kiss you, but I have to take off. Are you done? Are we done?